These picks came. Turn tail and run back beyond the wall. The Romans built that wall to keep us out, but they are gone, and we remain. Someday you too will disappear. Wall or no wall, we have more gods than you. We may have but one god hidden, but we have many more friends. Who now is the rightful king of Northumbria? The kingdom has spoken! May the skulls remember us!
Eyes open for the coward, King Rishi. For Thor! For Ragnar! For Hafton! Ah, oh, the sweet taste of victory! And Rishia defeated. Was he the thorn at my back? The traitor I suspected all this time? Save your praise, Hafton. Rishia may yet live. That coward will be dead in a snowdrift somewhere. It matters not. This day is not done until we've seen his corpse. Do not relent. Not yet. Eivor, rise like an eagle or caw like a crow.
to the north. You meet the spirits this day, traitor. Counselor, please help me back to Jorvik. Let my heart expire at home. I have no favors left to offer you, Rishir. Soon, you will walk beside your guard. But I... I see no light. I feel no warmth. Only... an icy darkness, a, a cave. Hell's frozen door welcoming you. What waits for me there, Eivor? What waits for me? A traitor's death for a treasonous fool. He was the hero in tales he told himself. A Saxon who loved his homeland. You cannot begrudge him that. Hmm. There is something in that. No more Saxon kings, Eivor. I am through playing the puppeteer. The fate of this Shire rests on my shoulders alone. You'll take the crown yourself, and the extra burden it brings. I will. But I will not rule alone. My friends, my allies, will keep me standing upright. Let us talk of our alliance in Jorvik. Leave this king to his winter kingdom.
nothing more to share for now. Moira, is Hafton about? Eivor, welcome. Danced with Hafton before. has stepped outside with Faravid. They shouldn't be far. I struggle to be surprised. I was caught off guard. The ceremony hastens to start. Let's not keep the crowd waiting. Eivor! Yes, let us go. To inscribe our names in history. No more pulling strings. This throne and its burdens are mine. rather be than splitting skulls by your side. Join your blade to mine. Let ring the sword song this day. Moira, how are things in weekend? I get by. There will always be those who dislike me, but how I handle their ire is up to me. So yes, things are mostly well. Have you had enough fun? My crowning must come soon! I'll save some for later. Let's make a king of you. To Eivor and the Raven Clan of Mercia, our newest ally in blood and glory! To Hafton King, I lift my horn and raise my brow to speak this praise. Crown Spire, Stout Oak of Valkyries, Spinner of Battle Wisdom, long may you live and rule. Skull! Skull! <coughs> Moira. What is this metal? It's soft, like Roman pipes. Ah, oh, that's lead. A toxic metal. And was it lead that drove the Romans mad? Can metal do this to a man? Oh, God in heaven, yes. The Romans knew this well. And my poor mother, she... She drank from cups like these for so long. She... You... All these years you gifted me poison! <laughs> you gifted me madness! Old friend, please. Your sickness has clouded your judgment. This sickness was no accident. I trusted you. Cheese your weapon, Farvid. Eivor, make this man see sense. He's old, sick, and his mind is unclear. Oh, shit! You want me dead, you lying shit hog? I was a fool to not see it! Oh. 
Treason must never go unpunished. After all we did together? After all we won? If any of my clan committed such a betrayal, I would rip his flesh from his bones. You are not the warrior you used to be, friend. End of our road. Stand, you treasonous bastard! Stand and fight me! Old friend, do you remember the days we raced our horses across the length of this land? You were always faster. You always won. Because I let you win, my arm. So I will let you win. One last time. We will meet once more in the corpse hall. Afton, it's time I go. Hmm? I'm leaving for Mercia, going home. And go with this. A sign of friendship. A bond between our clans, and a symbol of the pain and suffering it took to win the peace. I hope we were right about him. <laughs> now it seems the wind calls me back to Randvi. Let's tell her the good news.
It's Walden, I tell you. Don't be thick, Bron. Everyone knows Odin leads the wild hunt. Eivor, who leads the wild hunt? Odin? Why? I was explaining to him the way of Oscar A. This one wants to turn it into a pageant. Not a pageant, a parade. I was thinking some of us could dress up like gods from both lands. Maybe you could lead it, Eivor. Oscorea isn't a celebration. It's when the veil between the worlds grows thin and the dead will haunt us if we don't honor them. True. And they say the gods come to Midgard to hunt. Not just beasts, but men also. It wouldn't be wise to draw their attention. You are wise to be wary of the gods' wrath, Dane. <laughs> but it's not by hiding that you'll evade the wild hunt. I told you not to pester the locals, uncle. Have you been in the herbs again? Don't patronize me, you little shit. And you will call me Brother Maxwell like everyone else. No one calls you that. I've seen you around planting your smoking pots everywhere. The whole village smells like a seer's hut. Those pots are placed where the fabric of the veil is weakest, letting us perceive unseen threats before they are upon us. I'm sorry, Eivor. He shows up like this without warning. I told him he could stay with me while he's here. You're right to offer hospitality. And we should mark the Wild Hunt in some way. It's a source of fear for people of both faiths. And how do you think we should mark Oscorea, Eivor? With tests of skill and strength. Like Tira's archery range. Show the hunt, they'll find no easy prey here. Swinta is setting up another event since her last tournament was so successful. Good. Tell her we'll use it. Not to celebrate, but to prepare for the wild hunt. Tell her yourself. You're the one leading this preparation. Me? I didn't... And be sure to visit Goodman's homage to the dead. Or didn't you notice the ship in the middle of the settlement? I noticed the ship. Good. May Odin's wisdom guide you. So no parade. I have a better job for you, Ron. You'll be the judge of whose actions will impress the gods. You'll be the keeper of the tokens. I will be the best judge you have ever seen, Eivor. Go see Norvit about the tokens. Tell him I sent you, and I'll come find you later. My herbs let us see the invisible. But it's you, as leader, who must cross the veil and discover the mysteries of the Nether Realm. <sighs> I never said I was leading. Maybe I should have let Braun have his parade. What in the nine rounds was that?